The United States has the most job openings since the original iPod hit shelves, and unemployment is back to pre-recession levels. Yet retail sales are dropping. KOMU 8's Michael Down is here in the studio to make sense of the numbers. A new Commerce Department report shows that sales are down, marking the biggest drops between months since 2010. And like a set of dominoes, the stock market is also down to its lowest point since April. All these numbers come together to paint an ugly picture, but the answer to these numbers may actually be based more on your feelings. It's amazing how much difference a week makes. The national numbers are showing positive signs. All the way back then, unemployment was low and jobs were plentiful. Now, well, that's still the case. So why the bad sales numbers? Part of it could be in September's jobs report. The report did show some stagnant wage growth. We asked how confident people feel about the economy. Scary. I wouldn't say I'm overly confident. Uh, kind of a mixed bag. Consumer confidence is down, but the reasons vary. Some think it's the stock market. I think this the volatility in the stock market. While others think it's the president. We have an administration in the United States that really doesn't understand business, really doesn't understand foreign affairs. And others think the problem is international. I think because there's a lot of things going on in the world and in our national economy that have people worried that this is maybe falsely created. To an extent, all these opinions could be right because it's keeping them from spending money. So while the jobs numbers are good, it's obvious that people are just not buying what businesses are selling. Contributing to the smaller-than-average retail report was a drop in oil prices this month. We'll have more KMU8 news after the break.